Hey guys, I'm Adam. I'm Alex. Welcome back to Kearney Cards. What are we doing today? Flesh and Blood. Oh my god. Well, I'm, I'm really excited. We have a Flesh and Blood Tales of Aria uh, uh, sealed first edition box. And I'm really, really excited. Really excited. Oh, I didn't quite get it. I'm trying not to destroy the... <laughs> Too late. Within. Oh dear. I can't. Here. There we go. <laughs> My god. Okay. I'm sorry about destroying the beautiful box. It's okay, we have a second. And we'll treasure that forever. Here you go. Ooh. Here I go. You, do you want to go first and get us started? Yeah. Uh, 15 cards in each. Yeah. What have we standard. got in here? Pretty standard. Um. One token, 12 commons, one rare, one rare or higher, and one premium foil. Yeah. Okay. Oh, this is exciting. Yeah, it is. Oh my god, I mean, I didn't expect to be opening these yet. Even the back's really nice. These, yeah, I think these are going to be really pretty. Okay, I don't know else? if there's any, like, shuffling method to it, but, like, we'll just... I have no draw idea. Them as well. well, we've got, right. uh, got some attacks. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Life action. Cold wave, glacial hey, footsteps. You've got a oh, foil. it's a foil. They're very subtle. Yeah, very no, it's subtle. nice though. Rotten old buckler, <laughs> blizzard bolt, arcanic okay. sh uh, shockwave, another glacial footsteps, dazzling, dazzling crescendo, oh, that's cool. singeing steel blade, entangle, and a cracked bauble. That's nice. That is nice. Okay. So is that the token then? Maybe and and I guess so. Well, we'll see with um, mine as I open this now. But I think. Okay. Okay, I think maybe the foil then is in the middle because we. I guess we're learning as we go as well. Yeah. Oh, look at this artwork. That is nice. Wow. Yep. Okay, these are nice. They are very nice. Wow, and then the foil is, that going, is that showing up on there? Hopefully that is. That, that is, is nice. so pretty. Okay, all right. Oh, wow. We had a look, didn't we, before the yeah. video just to see what the uh, heavy hitters are and hopefully it'd be nice to, to get one of the... So I think the tokens are at the back. Gotcha, okay. I'm yeah. not sure. We'll, 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 we'll have, we'll have we a look. Go. Yeah, because yeah. we're both quite... Well, extremely new to this. Mm. Uh, we just liked the look of the art, really, didn't we? Right, there you go. Got so, so okay, artwork. so that's cool. So your foil is in the middle every time. Yeah. They, these are really lovely. Yeah. You, you liking the artwork so far? Yeah, I am. And then you've got the young version. So oh, that's for the, the Blitz For the Blitz version yeah. of the game. The quick mode. Yeah. Okay, right. Let's have a look and see what we've got. I think it's clever to have a quick mode in a game because you know sometimes they nice yeah snapshot for our foil oh, if there's anything like magic every single boot card will be ridiculously <laughs> strong someone loves boots at magic okay and then yeah oh Briar. yeah Briar. all right um I, i'm interested if anyone's watching the video just to know if people are playing yeah how popular it is um i know that there was a foil mulch cool i know that there was a um big tournament last year over in the states you know with everyone like masked up and trying to keep safe but that was very popular from what i understand yeah um and I, i'm curious to know what's happening with it over here and, and in, yeah. in europe you know oh foil thump nice that's cool yeah I'm, I'm into the artwork i really am yeah the artwork is really nice mm. yeah i'd be interested to know um how well it's doing in the uk how many people are playing yeah um because card market has just started sort of allowing allowing you um they've put up the uh ability oh is that two foils Oh, so it's one of those, a cold foil then. Maybe. Is that that one? That one looks a bit more unusual. Yeah. Maybe put that to the front. Coat of frost. Um, but yeah, you can sell these on card market now. 
Yeah. So which is where that is amazing. That would make me assume that it's gotten popular. Uh, Popular enough. yeah. Yeah. It's it being touted as the next big thing, isn't it? The next big card game. Yeah. Ball lightning for the foil. Uh, kind of excited in every pack to see the uh, hero at the back. Yeah. They're really... Look at that. These are really cool. Yeah. I can see a, a wide range of appeal here. A lot of um, variety in the heroes. Well, I, I like the heroes as well because I'm a massive fan of Planeswalkers in Magic. Does this... Uh, like sort of scratch that same itch then yeah it does really it's the same kind of nice looking pictures of people Mm. (laughs) which makes it sound really basic but Mm. i do like it no it's good yeah no this is this is cool yeah i'm loving the like rainbow decorations down the side It's, it's all kind of subtle but tasteful yeah um it's actually a hell of a lot more um subdued than a game called flesh and blood um, sounds like it's going to be. Yeah, it sounds a little edgy, but this yeah, looks pretty... But it looks fantastic. Whoa. Oh, wow, that is cool. Old him. And frostbite. <laughs> yeah, I'd be interested to see, um, as we kind of get to know it a bit more, what uh, heroes people prefer. That's mm, nice. That is really nice. Um, and what play styles people prefer. Yeah. Because as you were saying, well, as we were both saying, we're still learning it. So yeah. it may be worth, I think we should pick up a couple of decks. Yeah, and actually learn how to play um, cause, properly. <laughs> yeah, well, because I, I know that I want to play uh, with Dash. Yeah, Ever you since like I've been looking into Flesh you? and Blood, she's been top of my list as like, yep, she's cool. Um, yeah, you like the, um, was it kind of steampunk? Yeah, that steampunk vibe. Um, gluing gears to your hat kind of thing mm-hmm. I think that could be fun I think we should give it a, a fair shake yeah. and see how we get on that's that really yeah that's, that's nice. really nice it's a little hard to see yeah they really are subtle yeah uh, that'll probably keep them in nicer shape well that's going to be really interesting uh, uh, whether these curl or bend or warp or they feel Card quality feels mm. good. They feel pretty That's solid. That's cool. That is it's nice. Sigil of Suffering. Uh, we got a Foil Autumn's Touch. <laughs> Cracker Jacks. These are great. Yeah. Um, we'll have to give it a few weeks and see if they're in as good a condition still and yeah. what's happened with them. Well, I mean, they're already doing better. I mean, I feel like a lot of magic cards, you get them out of the box and they're already starting to... To walk, to curl a bit. Even worse with secret layer. Oof. Yeah, yep. but these feel nice. Um, they do feel nice. They feel thick as well. They, they... Are they the same size? They feel small. We'll get a magic sleeve yeah. in a bit and test that. Do you think they feel small? Yeah, they, it's a nice size on my hands. What do you think? You think in Yu-Gi-Oh size? Maybe, I'm not really sure to be honest, but they feel a decent size for my. Oh, wow. that's beautiful. I'm just going to pop that there. That's, that's gorgeous. absolutely stunning. Wow. Okay, that's, oh, that's my nice favourite. Well. Which one? The sort of Northern Lightsy looking. Oh, Blizzard Bolt, yeah. Embodiment yeah. of Earth and Lightning. Hmm. But yeah, I think we would have fun learning to play. Yeah. And I think with anything that you're dealing with, it's important to kind of know and understand the <laughs> game. Oh, there you go. Pretty. Look yeah, well. so and like um, we'll probably end up like getting all this listed up on card market, and then being like, oh, "Need that for a deck yeah. to try out," and just take that. Yeah, I'll have that. <laughs> well, you like any sort of deck builder, really. You're a, you're a deck builder kind of person. True. One other thing that I like about this as well is that it's com- wow. Is oh, that that's it's beautiful. Complete. Is that showing up on there? Hopefully. Uh, it's completely different to magic. Yeah. This is this the way that this is played with your hero having its health and <laughs> another Lexi um, having its health and equipment and then slowly being sort of whittled down throughout the game. I think that's really cool. I do. I've also just noticed. I think this is how they. So you've got your commons. It looks like there's a little C. Oh. And then is that a maybe a rare? And then a common. Common. So common, common, all commons. 
Yeah, so they put their rares in the middle because we've got yeah, a couple okay. and the little teeth are token. Te yep. So. Awesome. Well, that's okay, pretty cool. Okay, cool. Good, good spot. So, so, so does it that should make be... that a mythic? I think that might be a mythic. Oh, so mythic, co common. common, common. Yeah. So we got, oh, we got a mythic. That's pretty cool. Um, so this is the rare. Yes. And is that, but that's not our foil. So you've got your rare. Oh, and then you've got your, another, we've got another mythic. So that's that's it. That is, isn't it? I think so. With M for mythic I and the see. orange color as well. Uh, a foil entangle. Oh, that's such a good spot. I wonder if we've just glossed over. I think some we mythics. probably have. I think we should um, have a look at the end and pull out. Oh, see, this is exciting to yeah. learn all of this. So right, so you've got, got a rare, a rare, another rare. rare. A foil common. Back to your commons now. Yeah, okay. and then with a token at the end. With, and then and that should say T on it, yeah, at the back. T for token. Yep. Amazing. Okay. Right, I'm going to have a quick mm. look through and see if there are any. Yeah, and I'll, I'll just, oh, so we've got, yep, so Weave Lightning for our rare, Explosive Growth, and, oh, a foil rare, Bolt Ooh, and Shot. Lovely. Pop that there. As we open more and more of these, we'll get very familiar, I guess, with all of it. Um, right, let's see who our hero is. Old him again. So does he count as a... Yeah, he does count as a token. He's got the little T on him. Yeah. Interesting. So we got a... Um... Should I keep going while you're... Yeah, Ooh. please. I'm out, of, I'm out of packs. So we've got... Channel... So what are we up, up to? Three mythics so far. I wonder if there's um, if it's the same as magic in that... You're supposed to get about four per box, roughly. Possibly. It looks like you do get guaranteed a couple of rares per pack. Lovely. Okay. Yep. So we've got Weave Lightning. Oh, here we go. Flicker Wisp is our mythic in that pack. Oh, and Sting of Sorcery was a mythic that we missed as well. Well, I feel like this has gone all right. <laughs> uh, we've got a Foil Rare here in Bolden. Um, and then let's see what the rest is. And we've got... Okay, just the embodiments at the back. And then I'll do the last pack while you're having a bit of a scout. Obviously, we don't know for sure, like, pull rates and stuff yet, but I don't know. How many are we on? One, two, three, four, five mythics feels good. Feels kind of satisfying. Yeah. Uh, one thing, I'll, I'll go through this last pack and then I'll I'll sort of join you. Um, let's see how we, how we finish here. Weave Ice for a rare. Another explosive growth and a foil common just to finish off. All right, and let's see if we get a hero at the end. Nope, a lightning and a titan's fist. Um, so what I was going to say is it's really, it's it's the mythics don't look like mythics. They they yeah. just look like normal cards. Like yeah. they all look very similar. So I'm really glad that you spotted um, the little thing at the bottom. Yeah, that's certainly going to make things a little bit easier. Yeah. Um, but we've got a couple of um, foil rares, which is nice. Yeah. Um, and a foil mythic. Yeah, which is very, very nice. Very nice. Okay. Well, we are just about done here. So thank you, everyone, for watching. These are all going to go up onto um, Card Market in the next sort of day or so. Um, we'll pop a little announcement as well on Facebook and all that good stuff and Instagram and everything like that. Um, so if there's anything, if you play and there's anything you want, um, come and have a look. And I'll put the links below for our card market, our socials, everything like that. So uh, come and join us. And um, yeah, I mean, thank you for watching. Yeah, and, uh, this has been a lot of fun. Actually, yeah. I've really enjoyed this. Unexpected. Time yeah. to start ordering some more flesh and blood in. Yes, please. All right. Well, thank you for watching, everyone. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.